just pulled up to my buddy Luke's house. He actually just got a Volvo as well. He got an 89 uh, 740 turbo. It hadn't been run in six years, but we got it running. He traded a stack of wood for it. So today we're gonna be messing with it and getting it going. Uh, here's my buddy Sam Oates. We have matching sweaters because Walmart. $4, $4, Walmart. dollars. That's where it's at. So this is the badass 89 740. Um, Mr. Luke over here. Follow me. Uh, subscribe to my channel, S13 Luke. Oh, that's not a, that's not true. <laughs> anyway, B230 FT, just like mine, except for you know hasn't been run in six years. It's well, a, we got it running, but this one is a, uh, now we're working on it. It's wor it, it runs poorly. So we got some S70 injectors from the junkyard. They're high impedance and they're 32 pounds, so they're just slightly bigger. But we're gonna try to get them to work. One of the projects. Yeah, it's sitting on jack stands because we had to put tires on it. Because after you know six years, the tires were not up to par. But it's a pretty cool wagon. The interior is fairly clean, except for the fact that water's been leaking in it for six years, and that the guy used to store wood in it. So, as you can see, the leather is not that bad, but. I mean, it's trashed, and it smells really bad in here, like dirty pubes and llamas. And llamas. All right, Luke, so what's going on? So we just replaced the injectors with some that we got from Pull Apart today. Um, didn't do anything to the O-rings, of course, so just gonna see if they leak, so I'm trying to start it up here. Oh, you got a wiper. Okay, okay. Not gonna try to start it up here, the battery is very dead. So currently Luke is working on replacing the cap and rotor because it's six years old and we don't really know how good the spark it's is probably way older than because we're too lazy to test it. And then Sam is over here doing the real mechanics. Since we put those S70 injectors in, um, we have to take out the resistor pack. So Sam is going to go ahead and do that and rewire it. Let's not forget he looks very office. excited about it. Yeah, so next plans after it's running is basically hood stack, weld the diff, and slide it, slide it with me at the local drift events. So I'm uh, working on getting this rotor off and caliper, I guess. We're just gonna pinch the line with some vice grips. So this is how rusted it is. The whole disc broke off. So now we gotta sledge it off. Now we got the rotor off. We just broke the piece that was off, off. And uh, now we're just gonna bolt the caliper back up with a, uh, with a piece of wood in between the two pistons so it still pressurizes so we still have all of our other brakes. Garrett under here now. We're about to solve all the exhaust. We're right in front of the cat. I don't know if you can see it's kind of dark down there, but uh, he's gonna give it a shot. Oh, uh, got gotta get eye and ear safety. Oh, sure.
or halfway there. And that right there is how you cut a cat. Yes, sir. Good job, Garrett. Go ahead for Dale. Garrett's still working on the exhaust, just getting the rest of it out of the way here. What was all that? <laughs> Is it still hung up? Yeah, it's, it's got a hanger. So, the S70 injectors didn't work. Uh, our resistor pack is kind of messed up, so we don't know what the real issue is. Too high evidence. So we're gonna just put the stock ones back in and see if it starts. Push it on. Just the clip to face outward. All right, try it. Test one if we're There's getting no ground, so it might not work. Not seem to be getting fuel. Toss them in here and see what happens. Try now. Let's just, hey, hold on. No need to pump it just, there. Just bolt it up. See if it's there. You just push it down. Is it is it squirting there? No. no. Why? I'm not sure. Yeah. Uh, is the, the Volvo Swedish? Yes. SDM wiper. <laughs> Owns Volvo. Asks if Swedish. Test fire two. Oh. Oh. Almost. Oh, it's wanting to. Better jumper or what? Oh. We're close. Oh. We're close. Get up. Probably turn the wiper off, brother. It won't go off, stay though. Go ahead, because that's the end. Oh! I didn't talk. Ow. <laughs> Test start number three. Garrett, give her the beans. So now that it's been running, we've concluded that the misfire might be due to this turbo sweet turbo house. Oh, oh, I got some pretty shoes. Uh, so now we're working on getting the turbo house off. And yes, we say turbo house because in the ad it said it needs, a needed turbo a turbo house. house. Also, he so. looked everywhere for a turbo house, could not find a turbo house. So now we're going to try to replace this house. in about 30 seconds. Alright, that zip tie is off though. Give her a junior rip. Let's give her a pull. Oh man, that's gross. Oh, it's coming. No, it's not. No, it's just breathing hard. There! Oh, yeah, it's coming. Hey, who's going to come? Give him bark. Who's going to come? The kid, the kid, the kid. The kid. <laughs> Trevor Beth and I missed it. Oh, here we go. Oh. oh man. I got the duct tape off. <laughs> oh, there's where the turbo house is bad. Underneath. Right. Huh? Is it a split? Just a little hole. Oh, gross. That's disgusting. Yeah. Ugh. Man, can I borrow a knifey? Watch out. So as we can see, that's where the turbo house is ripped. Wait, what is this? Oh wait, is there another clamp on this? Yes, there is. Yes! I bet we can find a hose like this at Lowe's. Yeah. Oh yeah, for sure. We're about to go to Lowe's as soon as I get this off. Oh, for sure. We're taking the Lexus. Are we? Yeah. Why, why would we take the Lexus? Why would we take the Lexus when I can drive my diesel truck? Yeah, when we have a diesel truck. Shotgun.
right, so we're on our way to Lowe's, I believe, Lowe's to get a new turbo house. Um, hopefully they have it. If not, we're just gonna get a flex pipe. Did not work. Yeah, yeah, same now. Do that. Right. Nah, partner. <laughs> oh, this shit. Oh god. Yo. Please call two one five. Sam two one five. There's no way to clamp that. That's about more like it out there. That's about more like it out there. So the turbo host search is not too lit. We got Sam in the back, depressed. That's probably the use. Garrett thinks that we can use a metal one, but that's not true. So we're out here now. We couldn't find a turbo house, so we got a piece of pipe that we're gonna cut to make work instead and it should be pretty interesting full range of motion buddy we got our intercooler piping worked out it works the car is not misfiring so we just put it on the ground on three brake calipers we're about to go drive it and do some burnouts so we got it running not even misfiring it's on the ground about to take it for a test drive. All right, so that concludes our day. We completed our goal. I'm out of here. My hands are literally down my pants, but here's my ball hand. Thanks. Thanks, Ben. Solid Ripper Luke. I might see you tomorrow. We might continue.